FNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, Larry Pesavento for 2TFNN. Uh, what I'm going to do today, folks, is do things a little different. I'll give you a little update here, what's going on in the market. We've been up and down, and the stock market's still going higher. What's interesting here is let's try to get this so you can see I've got all these things that are just jumping around everywhere. But we'll take a look at the S&P. You can see what's happened today in the S&P is extremely important, folks. We took out the high. You can see the A. B, C, D pattern right up here at the 1.61 expansion at 46.10. That takes out that daily high, which was really important, folks. You see that high right back there? They took it out by three points, and now we've taken that out. What that means is that cycle that we've been waiting to come in on the 12th to 13th, this thing better come down into that, or this market's going to have lots of trouble. Uh, well, that means it might be down one and a half days. I don't know that for a fact. But there are a couple of the markets that uh, we're going to go through them one by one. I have a presentation that I'm going to give here on the difference between the three drive pattern and the one three five pattern. They're, they're, they're the exact opposite but have similarities. And someone asked me to take care of that. I'm going to do that. Uh, when the show starts up here, we got the bonds have sold off a little bit. They're down now two points from uh, – the high that they made up there at the 50% retracement at uh, 2020, uh, and we got down as low as 1820, so they only dropped about two points. The interesting one that we're going to be talking about and spend a great deal of time with is the gold market because uh, we had a really great setup that looked absolutely perfect, and then it said, hmm, maybe I'm not so perfect. And also we're going to review some of the ABCD patterns uh, that we look at on an intraday basis just to show – what we're watching here but this one is really important because the fact is we did not take out the highs of july they certainly did in the dow jones uh, and also in the nasdaq but we did not do that in the s p of course the russell is still setting at the 61 percent retracement of this whole move that we're setting in here so those are the things that we're looking at and uh, we'll see whether they line up but uh, there's going to be a really neat little powerpoint presentation it, well it's neat for me because it brings back a lot of memories of when I was studying these things uh, many years ago. So stay with us, 877-927-6648. 